Hi there, I am Andrew and today we play some Humankind together with Rude. So, in the last episode, we, re we have been really bad guys, but I like it, because we have already pushed the Yellow Kingdom, the Kingdom of Queen Valinong, um, really into a very, very bad uh, situation. They lost at least two of their... Um, how, can, how are they called? Territories. Um, and they are now trying to defend two cities, Kerma and Parsa, that they have altogether seven population and they have only one army, maybe two. I'm not 100% sure about that. But even if their armies are really, really excellent, due to the fact that the Immortals are an excellent unit, and honestly, I wanted to take Persia, but I, I, I wasn't quick enough, so... I had to stick to the Maya, which are also an amazing culture, but not exactly what I had in mind at the beginning. Um, but beside of that, I think that I will try to close this war in this episode. And as you can see in my capital, I'm already looking forward uh, building the um, lighthouse of Alexandria, uh, which will give to my fleet a better uh, opportunity to explore the world map fast. And uh, we will try to find um, other territory to colonize. For example, here there is an interesting archipelago probably, and here there is also another land that we can... Uh, we can colonize with an outpost uh, and then maybe here we might expand Rapa and here we can expand Tik Al. Let's close the turn, let's see what happens. Craftsmanship reserved, so now we can beat the charcoal kiln. We need two points of uh, copper, we don't have it at the moment, uh, and the artisan workshop. All right, our next technology is going to be the rhetoric and in, uh, in three turns we are going to get um, a scientific star, but more important, I want to have four districts to get another construction star. So I'm not moving into the next era before grabbing those stars. Fine. Now, I think we have we have to move to the war um, front. We're going to move this. Uh, wait, wait a second. I thought that I could maybe take one unit these wars and put here a territory so that I can heal my units while they move south. And in the meantime, I block this area. The city of Tikal will just quickly, quickly and swiftly build one unit. Uh, I, I would like to take actually an horseman because it's faster. And we will move the horsemen on this archipelago and we are going to build an outpost there. Now, How do you do? I can trade with other civilization. And seriously, did I forget to, to greet Makeda of the Huns? <laughs> I forgot. Okay, wonderful. Let's uh, uh, suggest a trade. Luxury trade, yes. Silver. We get silver, we get more science per turn. So, Makeda, oh man, okay. My dream to find a new world here is now... I think, I, I, I think that now I'm quite sad. The new world is probably here south. Most likely, not in this position. I, I, I probably found a, a little archipelago here, and that's not the new world. Which leads to the conclusion that if I want to get to the new world, I will have to conquer Parsa and Kerma and start from here. All right. All right. All right. Now, my boat here is fine. We can move it. And... Um... Let's click on next turn. Yeah, they have two armies. They don't have one. They have three armies. Seriously? Man, how, how are they even doing this? This makes no sense at all. This literally makes no sense at all. That's not possible. I, I try uh, a siege. I maintain the siege because I will try to force... Uh, the queen of the yellow kingdom to attack me and then in a defensive position here is such an easy victory this is such an easy victory guys Generous. and now we accept an aggression pact of course 
Wonderful. All right, now we try exp uh, we try and explore this area here. You see, all of my cities are, are pushing really um, hard so that we can build the Lighthouse of Alexandria as fast as possible and then we can grab another wonder. Tikal has now provided us with an explorer and we might do our second Tikal. Uh, a second Kunaha. Tikal is the name of the city. Sorry, my Mayan is not that fluent. Uh, I, I, th I think you recognize it. My English either, but... <laughs> All right, so now let's navigate a little better south. I want to see if I find any curiosity, for example, in the next turn. As soon as I grab uh, the, the lighthouse, I will be able to get those um, curiosities here in the same. Rhetoric is research. I can build the theater, the library, the holiday. The library is massive because I have very big cities. And this is going to help me a lot. It seems that they want really to... That's so sad. Uh, it seems that they want me to attack. Um, and they have... Look at, look at my army. Look at my army. And look at their army. I mean, yeah, sure, sure. They have some militia, but if I stick here and I stay for seven turns, I'm gonna win automatically. And something that I really like is to follow Sun Tzu when he says, win 100 battles without fighting one. But I actually like to fight, so I'm saying, I'm just bullshitting guys, don't listen to me so much. Good. Uh, now we discover the archipelago, we find, we figure out we have also some ebony here. Now a lot of gold, so I am going to trade on some mercury. And I, what happens? I, I, she's afraid of us. Oh my dear. Um, let's continue the trade of mercury. No, I don't have enough money. What? Seriously? What? Uh, what? Did you cancel my... Man, you are really bad. The Mongols, medieval ages already. They cancelled the trade uh, trade route with us. That's bad. That's really bad. Did we finish also this resource? Yeah, sure, we did. I think I, I, think I really need to clean uh, to, to finish the wonder so that I can then move and build like, the four districts a lot I did one as, as, as we said Lothar is gonna be my scientific uh, city so we, we try to push science here also food it's necessary but we do our best all right <clears throat> one turn Okay, we, we catch this curiosity. We get a wreck. So, it was good. Um, let me see if I can trade with someone else. Yes, I can. Silver. Lead. More science and porcelain. And we have it ready. And uh, green here. Alright. I'm doing well here. Fine. Fine, 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 fine. So, I think I should also need some... Uh, I, I should also settle here, but I don't have any units to be the outpost there. Scientific correspondence plus 10% science comes reduction on technologies reserved by the other empire. The goats are not a threat to us because they have only 2,800 victory points. So uh, maybe... I will give them an advantage, but maybe they will also give me an advantage if I beeline some researchers. So I, I accept this. I accept this. You see here I'm not earning anything, but in the future I might. So Militia will disband most likely in three turns, if I get it right. Wonderful. Okay, we can claim the next wonder. 
that would be the pyramid of the sun i don't want to claim this one i will wait for the next uh, era now rapa should definitely build a library but first first i need something different look at this great Moino Daro. I love the industry here, it's just massive. Right. Okay, we keep exploring and researching. Now we have six guys, six army actions with, with the with the pentacorter. I mean that's that's great. Tainted waters. Oh man, no, this is really bad. This is really bad. I'm going to lose so much gold now. Shit. Oh, this is so bad, this event. I'm gonna be in debt for seven turns, at least. Okay, let's wait another turn first. What do you want? Trade everything. I can trade everything, I don't mind. So. Let's uh, let's give an improvement. Let's uh, give a new tenet to our religion. And let's select a religion. Come on, let's take something nice. Let me have some, you know what I like a lot. I like uh, the Zoroastrian, but it has been already picked. <laughs> so we take a Shinto temple because I find it very, very stylish. Plus influence on religious district and a discount of enacting a civic, okay. Yield to none, it's giving more war support, we don't need it. Bear no false witness, is giving us plus 5 science on each research quarter. This is not bad, this is really not bad considering that we are already seeking wisdom. Plus money on the market quarter, plus stability on garrison and ma plus 1 combat strength in combat for unit in or adjacent to a district on garrison. Not bad, observe fast, plus food on harbor. Food is good, but uh, I'm afraid there is no production here. I'm gonna get, uh, again, science. Oh, there is a declaration of demilitarization somewhere. Now we build here our fantastic new little thing my question here i i see that there is something i will try one two three four five six i will try to navigate and i'm lucky i am lucky because i think that i found the new word i think that i found the new word folks look at this i think that i found the new word now and i think that in glica i have a very very good spot and as soon as we have the right technology, I can go into the new world and colonize it. So this guy here is just standing. Wonderful, 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 really. We need another district and we need another pop to then change our, our era. Tikal never built um, a religious quarter, which is actually probably what I, got, what I want to do, but first, I would like to see if I can boost my productivity. Not so much, okay. And also here, plus nine. That's, that's not so um, this super massive bonus that I would have expected. It's much easier to give up than, than an extra maker building here, right? Uh, next turn. Agrarian star earned. Imperial power researched. And wait a minute. I need another district. Shit. I thought that that was the last one. So oh, come on. No, not really. Hey, uh, just a moment. Uh, just a moment. Ah, man, I I now I understand what's going on here. Uh, actually, uh, this siege can go. Really. This siege can continue really for ages because the militia is. Uh, I'm killing one militia every. Wow. 
I might consider doing an automatic attack here. Because if I strike manually, what I'm going to have is only this area. It's going to be a very long and tedious and frustrating battle. I am stronger. I am going to kill them. I'm going to order now an assault with an instant resolution. So that I open... Look at this. Look at this. My army has been completely wiped out, but I get their capital. Yes, that's 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 not what I wanted to see, but I oh man, that that has been a mistake from probably from my side, but I think that I killed completely their army, so now I have only 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 javelins. Culture blessing. Let's get the multiculturalism. Kerma is our city now, and uh, they, they are losing war support due to the fact that, yeah, they have eliminated a lot of uh, our units, but I think I need to build a new army, unfortunately. I offer an excellent proposition. Oh, refuse, I'm not giving you my maps now because I, I just found the new word, so I would be stupid sharing it with the rest of, the, of my enemies. Now I'm going uh, um, on curiosity hunting. And I'm getting also some gold, probably. Let me see. Wreck 80 gold. Yes, this is what I need. Wonderful. 160. I mean, they are stopping some traders, but why? Why? All right. Minus fifty percent on our army cost and act. Oh, it's it's no problem for me. Let's move on. Let's go to Barça. They shouldn't have any army, okay? And they have only two pops, so they they can't stop me. I could attack them also with an army of rabbits. They they cannot stop me now. I hope. Okay, I'm going here for the profit sharing um, and I'm going to open my contact with the other little empire, Ekatompulos. Let's see. All right, now we have the interpreters and we have also the quadrim and a builder star. Okay, with the builder star, now we uh, jump to 6,000 points. We can jump also to the new, to the new epoch. Arapa. No, 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 not you, not you. Arapa can build right uh, very quickly the library so that we boost a little bit our science. That's important. Mm. I, I cannot keep a promotion because I'm out of my borders, but we get another wreck. Let me see if I can trade. Can't remember exactly Mercury. I can do Mercury here in lead, probably. Yeah. And there is still a civic that I have to pick. Uh, plus one science per number of trade routes on city or outpost. And uh, I'm going to get also 5% science. So we take it immediately. Uh, this is a. So now our science is 424 per turn, which is very high. I like it. Yes. And I refuse the monumental contractors. This is an agreement that I really do not do not appreciate. Maybe you can tell me in the comment section if uh, I'm wrong, because I can't really see the use of it. Um, I I don't like it too much. I, I need to be very very honest with you. So here, uh, wh wh who's my enemy? Okay, there is another army here. Okay, fantastic. I'm going to maintain the siege. If they go out, probably I'm gonna lose. So I bring here now more units, so I have more strength. Lothal um, should definitely build a unit, maybe a warrior, so that I can take control of this area and then enter with the warrior in Parsa. Then we will have to build our army from scratch. 
Diplomatic cooperation. Accept. Accetto, ma solo per una questione di opportunità. Esso. All right. It's time to it's time to grow, guys. So, the Mongols already happen to be chosen. So, Queen Budica is the Mongols now. What should I pick? I tell you one thing. I love the Teutons and I have a religion and I can uh, spread this religion on an entire continent now and later if I'm good enough maybe on two continents and for every follower of my religion I'm gonna get one gold and one science and I plan to grow a huge population of my religion so I mean the Teutons will give me a real great boost into in economy and science and I'm trying to do it so we move to the Teutonic Order. Moenodaro is now ready to build probably the barracks first and the parade after, so that Moenodaro will be our barrack city and we will build the new armies directly here. Next turn. Wisdom and tech. And we are in a new era. Okay, so good thing is that uh, our enemy didn't decide to attack us, and we have already we're already building some ballistas, so we will have some siege weapons that we might use. I think that this this is not lasting too long. You have my but before the war support uh, drops to zero, I need to attack. I've been very slow here. I am aware. In this war but it, it would have been much better if I didn't destroy completely my armies that has been probably the biggest mistake so far if I played and if I fought myself it would have been much better and now it's too late I'm going to build two other uh, galleys because I want to explore faster um, you intrigue me. and Let's now we have the Huns are asking uh, for an alliance. Um, I accept the alliance for the simple reason that I will get some some percentage, uh, some extra science if I do some wonders. I think. I mean, some wonders are already gone, but not all of them. Good. No, I, I refuse the scientific correspondence. Sorry, that's absolutely no deal. Okay, here we have only three points, we, we skip the turn. Now we go into the research uh, panel because I need to get one technology, but I think that it's not. this is not here. I need to, to get a technology that allows me to go to the new world and it's this is not the cog. It's not naval artillery. I can't remember it. No, I, I, I'm definitely not. Maybe seafaring mastery. <sighs> or naval artillery. Can't remember. Anyways, let's go to uh, the feudalism to have the colony model and then theology right away. That's important. Oh, great. We can jump on the other side. Look at this continent. I need absolutely to colonize this area. So Tikal, we get attached and we have a new, uh, immediately a new start. We have also here a, um, a quadrium that gets a curiosity. And this is giving us a cog. Wonderful. Actually, don't keep them together. That's wrong. I think that the cog will start exploring uh, the, the southern part of, the, of this. So, wow, wonderful. Okay. No, go here, man. Where are you going? 
Oh, sometimes the, sometimes the pathfinding here is really, really funny. Really funny. So, land rights. Um, no, I don't want to think about the land rights now because I want to claim the wonder. Due to the fact that the Forbidden City has been already picked by the Mongols. Plus 25 war support increase when going to war. I mean, it, it's big. Um, the Angkor Vat will give me food per faith. And due to the fact that I consider having a lot of faith, maybe this could be also a great uh, thing. The Great Mosque of Genet is giving me a plus 5% additional fame, which is also great. I mean, 5% is not that much, but uh, now we'd have at least, I don't know, around about, I don't know, 30, 300 um, points more. Mm. Notre Dame is giving me plus faith per resource technology, and this guy, the Todai G, is giving me faith. Um, no, I, I I think I'm going for the Angkor Vat at the beginning. And we claim it. So, Dotal now is building this, the religious quarter. And the third will be the outpost. And then we enter the war, the, the siege. Okay, we have already a ballista. And in a few turns, uh, uh, the rest of the militia is gonna die. So you go in the open sea because you can do that, I think. And you go south. We try to explore our new world from a different perspective. Very good. Look at this. Wow. That's a lot of money. Um, no, with them I cannot trade. <laughs> I did a little mistake. Can buy a lead. I can also trade. No, uh, let, let, let me try to see if I can trade with them now. They ask for 1300. It's very pricey. They are in the second place. They will never give me any advantage. I understand it. All right. Okay, Arapa build the school. Now um, I am going to pick very quickly. <clears throat> I could get the Gothic Cavalry. Seriously, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it because first I will bring the Gothic Cavalry here and settle uh, to a settlement and then I will have the Gothic Cavalry, Cavalry in my army. And the next turn I think I will try to rush. I should have an extra Ballista. They, they should have a, a one less militia. We try to get this city. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching. And uh, if you like the video, please consider leaving a thumbs up. See you next time.